Welcome to Ms. Tally's math class. Have you ever gotten frustrated with solving a math word problem? If so, you have come to the right place. I'll be guiding you through a short strategy that will help you solve any math word problem. It's called cubes. Cubes is an easy strategy that stands for circle, circle in the key numbers, U for underlying the question, B, box any math action words, E, evaluate, ask yourself what steps do I take, and S, solve and check. Does my answer make sense, and how can I double check? So let's begin with the problem. Here I have a multi-step word problem. The question says that Victoria walked five blocks from her house to the bus stop. She rode the bus seven blocks to the library. Later, she came home the same way. How many blocks did Victoria travel in all? Let's begin with the first letter, C. C stands for circle. We always need to circle the key numbers of our problem. So let's circle 5 and 7 because the problem said she walked 5 blocks from her house to the bus stop and she rode 7 blocks to the library. The next step is U. U stands for underline. Now we need to underline what the problem is asking us. Let's underline how many blocks did Victoria travel in all. So far we circled 5 and 7 and underlined how many blocks did Victoria travel in all. Now we are at the letter B, that stands for box. Our next step is to box any math action words. When we look at the problem, we see that Victoria walked five blocks and rode seven blocks to the library, and the same distance back home. The question asks how many blocks did she travel in all? So I'm going to box the words in all because it tells me that I need to add. E stands for evaluate. Let's evaluate what steps to take. Let's start with Victoria's walk to the bus stop. She walks five blocks from her home to the bus stop. From the bus stop, it takes seven blocks to get to the library. Seven plus five equals 12. When she returns home, she takes the same way. Our last step is S for solve and check. So let's solve our problem. We can add 12 plus 12 because that gives us 24. Altogether, she traveled 24 blocks in all. Now let's check our answer. The last step asks us to double check our work and to see if our answer makes sense. The answer we got was 24, so let's subtract each number that we have and we should get 0 as our answer. There you go. Wasn't that easy? We solved the problem by circling key numbers, underlining the question, boxing math action words, evaluating our steps, and solving our problem and checking our answer. Always use cubes to solve any math word problem. Just try it yourself. Thanks for watching.